In this tutorial, we will teach you how to crop images in Photoshop. To crop an image in Photoshop is not even easy, but a very important task that you will be performing frequently. A typical crop deletes all parts of the image that you want to let go of. The first thing we need to do after opening the image is to select the Crop tool by going in the Image menu or by pressing the C button on the keyboard. Make a box around the area inside the image that you want to crop off. If you're not satisfied with the crop, you can adjust the crop boundaries as per your need. Once you're done with adjusting the crop frame, simply press enter or double click in the crop frame to delete the unwanted pixels. At any moment, if you wish to cancel the crop, press the escape key. There are times when you need to perform a specific sized cropping, for example, four by six inches or eight by 10 inches. So for that, there are two ways. One is that you enter the width and the height of the image you want manually by going on the Crop Tool Options bar at the top. The other way to get this done is through the preset tool already available at the top left. It has the most commonly used measurements as options, which you can conveniently choose. Photoshop will make a crop frame according to those measurements. The Hide Crop option is used when, while cropping, you do not want to delete the pixels outside the crop frame as you might need them later on. For this, you need to have a transparency layer since the background layer cannot be deleted. Therefore, double click on the background layer to produce a layer that supports transparency. Now select the crop tool and make a crop frame. Before you press enter, what you need to do is go to the crop options bar and click on the hide option. What this does is that it hides the rest of the image behind the layer and you can easily move the image around by using the move tool, which you can select by pressing the V key. This would not have been possible had you been on the default background layer, which does not support transparency. If you are not okay with hiding all your pixels that were outside the crop frame and you want to get the whole image back, then what you have to do is go to the image menu and choose the reveal all option. What this does is that it automatically brings back the whole image that you had cropped before.